Um, so this is a food service. So the sticker says the birthplace of democracy. Um, but I don't know what um, place this is from. So we're going to dive on in. This is September's box. I did order August, but I guess it got lost somewhere. So they're going to hopefully resend me one. But I want to open this up and get into it. So if you want to see what I got in my Universal Yums box, then keep watching. If this is the first time you've ever seen my face before, I don't know what you're doing. You need to subscribe. Click the bell so you never miss out on a single video when I post. Uh, without further ado, let's go with it. Pew! Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an unboxing. As you can see, we're doing a Universal Yums unboxing. Okay, we are getting in. We are getting in. I'm so excited. I didn't look at what the thingy was this um, time around, like the place. I think, I don't even remember last month because it was so long ago, but. Cut and shake off. Wow. Okay. Here we go. I'm so excited. I like food. Okay, we're opening it up. So it's grease. All right. So on the top, it just says grease, and it has this little thingy. What is this guy? So this is probably the booklet about all this stuff. Oh no, it's not. Oh yes, it is. So you can. So on here it says. Okay, so it has like places of where all this stuff came from. Okay. And then on the back it has just some games and then you can have like the awards. So this is all the stuff that I got in the box and so I can um, uh, review it. So that's cool. So we'll just put that aside. And then this is probably about the, ooh, I'm excited. Oh my god. Okay, so then this must be the about thing. Or is it just games? Okay, yeah, so it has all these stuff in it, so we are going to start. So the first thing on top is this guy. So this is Toddy's Chips, Oregano, I don't even know what that says. Let's read about it. So Toddy's Chips, Oregano, oh my god. Oregano Potato Chips. If you end up going gaga over these Greek potato chips, you have... One person to thank, Luanus Capodistris, the first Prime Minister of Greece. Okay. Okay. We're going to open it up and try it. Smell interesting. Okay, so we're just going to try a little one because I'm scared. actually not that bad they just kind of taste like potato like normal potato chips with a little bit of um a little bit of flavor to them cool okay okay next Ooh. bruschetta these are again toddies so toddies pine bakery bruschettini pizza cheese tomato basil so they look like little crackers Let's see what they say. Bread crisp with cheese, tomato, and basil seasoning. If there's one food that all of Greece can agree on, it's crunchy bread. The country's beloved twice-baked bread has been a national mainstay since ancient times because it's slow to spoil. Okay. Let's open this up. Yes, we're going to try everything because what is a food box about trying everything? Okay, so they're little chippy things. They smell good. They're really salty. Like... They're really good, but like they have a really kick of salt. But okay, cool. Moving on. Kristinaki mini breadsticks, basil pesto flavor. Okay, interesting. 
Basil pester breadsticks. Open this bag and you'll instantly notice one thing. The unmistakable scent of basil. That's likely what Il Alexander the Great noticed too when he first discovered basil dotting the landscape of his newly conquered territory. Okay. Let's try this as well. Okay, so yeah, the little min miniature breadsticks. They're not soft, so they're gonna be crunchy. Okay. Not my favorite. Oh gosh, okay, I don't like those, sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay. Moving on. <clears throat> Minnow's Nut Bars. Peanut and Honey. So this looks really good. I'm not going to open this. I'm probably just going to take it to work tomorrow. Or whenever I go to work. Because it's like a bar. So I don't want to open it. Um, but that looks really good. Um, peanut and Honey. Can't really go wrong with that. Um, what is this? Sorrenta Triple. I don't know. But it looks really good. It looks like it has cake hazelnut and chocolate let's read milk chocolate coated hazelnut topped wafer with cream filling we're trying this one Okay, so it smells good. It's a little bit melted, but that's fine. So it just is the wafer. And then you can see the hazel that. Maybe. If I put it down, it's going to fall out. Oh. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That was really good. Yeah. A plus for that one. Okay. Next. Toadie's Sorrenta Finger. So this looks again just like a chocolate wafer. Um, I'm not going to open this one just because it's only one and it just looks like a chocolate wafer. So, cool. <clears throat> so it's a grape flavored cookie. We're going to try this one because um, that is interesting. A grape flavored cookie. I need my scissors to open up this one. Oh, that's so weird. So it's a soft cookie. Yeah, it's really crumbly. It tastes like a gingerbread cookie. What the heck? But it's great. So that's really weird. It tastes like a gingerbread cookie. Like, what the heck? Okay, moving on. What the heck is this? So, <laughs> sweet bread with chocolatey cream filling. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
is it literally just a loaf it's literally just a loaf of bread in a package so we're just gonna take a little bit didn't get any filling but that's okay and we're just gonna try it like it's literally a loaf of bread so the bread tastes like What are those bread, those buns you have? Hot cross buns. That's what the bread tastes like. It tastes like a hot cross bun bread. That's really good. Okay. Next. Traditional Greek pastry. Okay. So they're just shoved in this little thing. So let's see, it looks like cinnamon maybe? Oh, no, I'm not sure what that is. Okay, let's take a bite. Okay. So there is something nutty in it. And then I think cinnamon. Maybe? I don't know. Okay, the next thing is a dark chocolate chunk cookie. I'm not going to open this one because I already know what a cookie tastes like. But then we got this. So it's the yum bag full of fun. We're gonna open it. Oh yeah, so it just has some little candies in it. Little candies, okay, cool. Um, so that was everything for this box. This is really cool. Like, I will definitely do this again. Um, it's so cool like, seeing all the snacks and treats and all that that you can get. Um, <clears throat> there's definitely a lot of cool things. Um, some things I'm a little questioned about, but I am now going to go take this all to my boyfriend and he's going to try it all. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more food tasting unboxing videos, let me know. I'll gladly do that for you. Um, yeah, so that was awesome. I, for some reason, cannot get... There we go. I got it back in the package, finally. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to take all this to my boyfriend's house. And, um... He's going to try it all. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below, subscribe down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Think I can fly, think I can fly when I'm with you. My arms are wide.